If you want to get realistic lighting, you should create DOM light with HDRI maps. There are hundreds of maps and it's very hard to find the best one. Today I will show you my favorite HDRI maps, which I use very often. This is my scene and firstly I will create DOM light. To do this, I click on the DOM light icon and place it somewhere here. Then I go to the asset editor, to light tab, and this is my DOM light. Let's go to the settings, it's on the right side, and here I have place to load the texture, HDRI map. Then I change the intensity, mostly I set the intensity to 50, 70 or 100. I will set it to 70. Then I change the shape to sphere and let's choose HDRI maps. I use mostly polyheaven.com with many HDRI maps. They have very high quality. On the left side, I have HDRI maps. That's why I click on browse HDRIs. And here I have hundreds of maps with very high quality. I will show you my favorite ones. First map is Canon. All the links to the HDRI maps are in the description of the video. As we can see, this is very ambient light. To download this map, I go to the right side, choose 4K, HDR, and download. If your file is downloaded, just go to SketchUp, to Asset Editor, Color Texture HDR, and load the proper file. I click on the folder icon and choose Canon 4K. It's uploaded, I go to the previous asset, Remember that if your HDRI map is uploaded, you can always change the position of this map. Just go to the texture slot and here there is texture placement. You can rotate this map by 90 or 200 degrees. If your map is rotated, it will light differently. If you want to learn more about HDRI maps, check out my tutorial on YouTube. It's in the upper right corner or in the description of the video. Also check out my very first SketchUp visualization course in which you can learn how to create highest quality visualizations in very first SketchUp. Okay, let's check the render. And this is my visualization. The result looks very nice, very realistic. It's very impressive. And let's take a look. I've created the scene during 6 minutes and 58 seconds. The light in the interior is very ambient, very attractive. Let's try something different. This time I want to show you colder, more bluish lighting. And this map, Rook and Kreutz, will be perfect. I go to the V-Ray Asset Editor and change the map. I go to the previous asset and render. And let's see that this lighting is more bluish, more cold. Let's compare it with a Canon map. On the right side, this is Canon. And on the left side, this is Rocken Kreutz. The difference is visible. Let's see that if I compare the time of render, using Rocken Kreutz HDRI maps, it took longer to create the render. With Canon map, it was faster. It's very important to know that each HDRI map works differently. That's why the time of rendering process is also different. I would like to get more warmer lighting. To do this, I will use another HDRI map. This is Belfast Farmhouse. Let's see that the lighting is very warm. We have sunlight here, so there will be a lot of yellow lighting. Let's take a look. I upload this map and check the result. The scene is much different. We can notice sunlight over here. Also, the colors are much warmer. And if I compare it with the previous HDRI map, we can see the difference. On the right side, we have Belfast Farmhouse and on the left side, Rook and Roids. Okay, but what about the time of render? Unfortunately, I needed 14 minutes to create this visualization, so it took much longer. What about the sunset? I prepared such map. This is Little Paris Eiffel Tower, and let's see that we have a lot of lights here. We have sunset here, and I think that the effect will be really interesting with this map. I upload this map and render. And let's see that the scene is darker. We have visible sunlight, and we can say that outside the window it's sunset. Let's compare it with the previous HDRI map. On the left side, we have Belfast Farmhouse, 
And on the right side is Little Paris, Eiffel Tower. It depends on you. What effect do you want to obtain? What is the most interesting for you? It's very important to check the time of rendering, almost 14 minutes. So it's quite a long time. Let's create something totally different. Night scene. To do this, I prepare the map. Let's try with this map. I download it and upload it to the dome light. Let's see the result. And this is our result. The interior is very dark. I think that we need more artificial lights. That's why I will expand the right sides, go to the light mix and turn on more lights, more rectangle lights above the tabletop and change the intensity of other artificial lights. I will change the exposure and I think that the effect is very interesting. The scene is totally different. Let's take a look at the time of rendering. It took only 4 minutes and 30 seconds to create such interesting render. Let's compare all these results. This is Canon, more bluish Rukenkreuz map, much warmer Belfast farmhouse, looking like sunset Little Paris Eiffel Tower, and night scene using Deco Hollow Night. These are my five favorite HDRI maps, which I use very often, and I recommend to use it in your projects. Thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe to the channel and leave a like. Check out my website edac.org with many SketchUp and V-Ray courses. See you soon. Bye.